So I busted up my foot last night in the dumbest way possible. There was a soccer game and I got all excited because it's harkened back to my high school days and I got Laura competitive and if you know me in real life you know what that is. And I busted up my pinky toe on my left foot. It like split so there's a big flap of skin and I hobbled down to the infirmary and put on that alcohol nonsense and I had to literally scream because it stung really, really bad. And um, I twisted my right ankle from that like 10 years ago twist that has kept me weakened. That time that Mimi took me out with like a swift kick to my ankle and a scrimmage. She was on my team, not during the scrimmage, but in general. So at that point my ankle was messed up for like eight months, like grapefruit size. But I wanted to share a little bit of the camp because I'm here and some people will never get to experience the Woodstock Fruit Festival because it doesn't fit into their schedule. It's kind of expensive. They just don't have the time. So this is it. It's incredibly beautiful. Just so you guys get the lake. I didn't even think I was going to be doing this. Um, spur of the moment video. A lot of people are getting hurt. Jenna, we need you at the infirmary because everyone's getting hurt. <laughs> um, yeah, my friend John smacked his face while doing exercises and he had to get stitches, so I'm incredibly lucky that it's just that my leg's a little messed up. So here's the lake. It's so beautiful, right? Like, this is just the ideal place. If it didn't snow here, I would love to have the farm. There's a, just a ton of tents and cabins and sports places. It's a summer camp for kids, so um, it's really meant for like fun and physical activity and there are little golf carts and a rope course and rock climbing. I went on the paddle boards and I just, I'm meeting amazing people. It's so fun and lots of people here want to start farms. A lot of people are talking about whether it's animal sanctuaries or like a farm share. Um, there are a lot of people who are interested in gardening and then a lot of people who are really interested in just raw food and I think that they should be growing their own. So I'd love to teach classes on germination and soil. And you guys have to see this puppy. You guys have to see this puppy. Oh, hi Rocco, please be in my video. Hi. Oh, so cute. So you're teaching him to skateboard? Yeah. Hi. We'll see if that works. You're cold because it's raining. Oh. Exercise them a little bit so we could go when we get where we're going. Sure. Look at that little guy. Morocco. Goodbye. So cute. Hi. There's Jonathan. Jonathan teaches tie dyeing, and he's really cute. So I keep trying to set him up with my friend Stephanie. Um. She likes guys with long hair. Hey, Stephanie. Sorry that I'm talking about you. Um, <laughs> that's fine, because by the time you see this, you're going to be back in Canada. <laughs> so, walking up this giant hill. My ankle actually feels better. <sighs> so, yeah, I'm just going to keep massaging it. I did a Thai massage class yesterday that was amazing. It was a workshop, so I actually learned how to do it. And the first time around, I had a partner, and I was massaging her which was good practice. And then the second time, he asked for a volunteer. So I was the demo person. So I learned exactly what he had meant when he was saying everything. That was super helpful because there were things I didn't understand, like he was pulling on my head a little bit. Now I know exactly how to give a professional time massage. So here's the court that is responsible. I'm responsible, but here's the court where I damage my foot like an idiot. It's a giant rec center. People keep playing piano. Everyone seems to have like amazing musical talents. There's this girl who's playing ukulele and guitar. She's doing a bunch of Regina Spector songs, like my favorite songs in the world. And I sing. It's wonderful. And then Stephanie was playing guitar. We have people on drums. There's didgeridoos. I'm about to go into an exercise class, but um, 
I'll talk to you guys very soon. I love you. I just I have to be quiet because I don't want to interrupt them. So, just, right? It's good, right? I mean, like, look at that. You, just, you can't get better than this. This is my place. Like, some people love the beach. Some people love desert. I love the woods. Being here is amazing. I feel like this is my, no, like, this is my home. It's going to be hard to go back to the city. Look at this. It's gorgeous. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay, got to be quiet. It's Dr. Sam. He told me I had good bone rhythm when I was doing my squats. Okay, I'll talk to you guys soon. Hope you're having a great summer. I love you so much. Two more days here. So excited.